Okay, now <clears throat> if we go back again to the structure of the DNA, we can see that the DNA again is made of two strands or two backbone, okay? Uh, each backbone is made of a group of nucleotides. The nucleotide is made of phosphoric acid with a sugar called deoxyribose plus a nitrogenous base. And then we said we have four types of nitrogenous base, T, A, C, G, thymine, adenine, cytosine, and guanine. And on the other side, also another uh, strand or backbone also of DNA, also made of nucleotides. What you can notice here, uh, from the exercises also, we discovered that the number of A equals the number of T, because A and T always bind together, so they are complementary. C and G are also complementary, so that's why their numbers are equal. Okay, so A always equal to T, and C always equal to G. Okay, and the DNA will form a double helix, as we said. This DNA is wrapped around proteins called histones to form the chromatin. The chromatin, it condenses to become chromosome. To become chromosome. Okay, very good. Now, okay, let's see what happens to the DNA during uh, replication of chromosomes, how the DNA is replicated, yani how we make a copy of the DNA. Tab. Who can remind us what are the phases of the cell cycle? What are the phases of the cell cycle? Says Bulun Anna? Yalla yada. Um, interphase. Oh, interphase and prophase. Mitosis in general. Ah, ah. Sah. Interphase. an interphase and mitosis. Mitosis. Yeah. Type interphase. It's made of three steps. The interphase itself. We have, if you remember, the G one. We have S, and we have G two. So. We have G1, S, and G2. During G1, we said there is growth of the cell, okay, and like a kind of uh, preparation. In S, who can tell me what happens in S? Who remembers if we mention this? What happens in S? Who can remind me what happens in S? Okay, during the S phase of the interphase. Tab. In order to help you, to remind you, let's say that during mitosis, the cells divide. Each cell becomes two. So, do the chromosomes divide directly so each cell gets half the amount? Or, there should be a replication of the chromosomes before division. What do you think? Do we have replication before division? Ahmed, Khalid, where are you? Yusuf? Yalla ya Ahmed. I will repeat. Do we have, Ya Ahmed, replication before division or we do division directly? What do you think? Do we have replication? Should the chromosomes replicate before they divide? What happens if the chromosomes do not replicate? 
Do not make a copy. Uh, maybe still the conservation. Exactly. Well, uh, Can each cell take the whole set of the chromosomes? No. No, it cannot. So that's why we have to do the replication. We have to do the replication. Meaning, meaning that replication should occur. Type. Replication occurs in which phase? In interphase. Type. Which part of the interphase? It is in the S phase. That's why we call the synthesis. Yani making a new DNA, making a new chromosome. Type. Since the chromosome is made of DNA, this means that DNA should replicate, should make a copy of itself. Okay, DNA should make a copy of itself. The question now is, how can DNA replicate? How can DNA replicate? In order to make another copy. Okay, in order to make another copy. How we can do this? This is what we are going to discuss in the next part. But it seems that Guys, you are away from the lesson. You're not studying. Why? I told you we, we are going to make a quiz soon. Are you, are you ready for the quiz if you do it on Saturday or maybe Sunday? Are you ready for it? Saturday or Sunday? What? I will tell you tomorrow, inshallah, what time it's going to be. But it's going to be Saturday and Sunday. And it will include karyotype, mitosis, meiosis. Type, are you ready for this? I will not put DNA. But I will put karyotype, mitosis, meiosis. So prepare and study, please. Prepare and study. Type. Let us go to the part about DNA replication. Okay. Look with me here at this figure. Now identical reproduction in the cell cycle, I mean in the S phase of the interface. During S phase of the interface, huh? Hadi now enters. Taib, I want to read the boxes, please. Now each one will read a box. Yalla, prepare. Who will take the first box? Who will take the first box? Yalla, yeah, then. Father. A DNA replication. A chromosome of single chromatid is obtained at the end of mitosis uh, telo. Telophase. This chromatid consists of DNA of double strand. For so the chromosomes originally and after division, it is one single thread made of DNA. So now one single thread made of DNA. Now, the next step. Yalla, who will read the next step? I'm ready. Yalla, tfaddal ya Yusuf. It's a single chromatid decondenses, decondenses into, DNA. into DNA. This is called uh, G1. Of interface. For so during G1, the chromosome decondense. The chromosome decondense into DNA. Now it's become a thread of DNA. Look, containing here. Look what it contains. A, 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 C, G, C, T, T, G. The opposite 
TTT, GCG, AAC, depending on what is opposite to it. What is opposite to it? Okay, very good. Now, this is the DNA. طيب. The next phase now. Yalla. Who will read the next phase? Hadi O Khalid. O Ahmed. Yalla. The next phase. Fadali Ahmed. Third box, please. During S phase of interphase, the double strands of DNA open by heli helicase enzyme and then each strand undergoes replication by another enzyme called DNA polymerase. Polymerase. Stop, Ya Ahmed, here, please, a little, Lo Samahat. If you uh, please. Okay, so you're saying that during the S phase of the interphase, now, the double strand of DNA open by helicase enzyme. Like, let, let us look at the figure, please, all of us. So now, what did you do, Ya Ahmed? You cut the bond that is holding the bases together. Okay? Faizan, you're breaking the bond. You're opening the two strands. You're opening the two strands. Taib, do you know what the meaning of zippery, Ahmed? Ahmed, do you know what is a zipper? It is like opening of a zipper. You know what is the zipper, sah? Others, do you know what is the zipper? Sahab. It will become the jacket, or the, for example, the what do you call the jacket? The the bag, the shanta. Sahab. And you see the two parts attached together. When you move the zipper. The two parts move away. And this, what the helicase enzyme does. This, what the helicase enzyme does. Okay? So, it's like a Ahmed opening a zipper. نفتح السحاب. هيدي وظيفة مين? الهليكيز enzyme. Then, then what we do? Then we have another enzyme called DNA polymerase. DNA polymerase. Two of this enzyme will come. One will read this strand. The other will read the second strand. What do they do? What do they do now? The two DNA polymerase. Ahmed, are you still with me? Type, please follow with me if you can and raise your voice a little. Okay, this is A. What is the opposite to it, Ya Ahmed? T. T. Uh, the other A? T. A. T. C, G, G, C, C, G, T, A, T, A, G, C. So the first, D, the first DNA polymerase enzyme will start to build the new strand based on the old one. In the opposite side, there is another DNA polymerase command. Command reading these bases and building command the strands t a t a t a g c c g g c a t a t c g tab ahmed look at the two dna molecules here 
What do you What do you see? When? Hold. This one. Do you see the mouse cursor? No, I'm buying and You don't have the image. بس مبين الصورة العادية بس بين الناس هاتلا عشان خذ ضيع بس مبين الصورة اسمعي مبين هاد التبت الماوس الماوس كورسر is not does not appear yes طيب يلا يا أحمد اوكي اسف بس هلا حركت ارجع طيب احمد اوكي لوك ويز مي احمد طيب ان ذا ميدل ناو يو هاف تو دي ان اي صح؟ ان ذا ميدل يو هاف تو دي ان اي رايت؟ طيب ذا فيرست دي ان اي هاز وان ستراند بلاك وان ستراند ريد صح؟ صح. Okay. The black strand is the old one. The original one. The red one is the new one. That you built it according to the old one. يعني أنت you read the old one and you put the complementary. طيب. Look at the one on the left. Uh, or on the right هلا. Come on, you have a black on the right and purple on the left. صح؟ Okay, which one is the new? The purple. The new is purple. Mumtaz. طيب. Now, you have two DNA molecule. The first one is a black and red. The second one is a black and purple. Correct? طيب. Now the question, Ya Ahmed. If you compare these two DNA, Are they identical? Yes. 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 So now, if I give to each cell one of these, it's identical. Well, I mean, with the DNA. For example, now each cell get an exact copy of the original DNA. An exact copy of the original DNA. This means the copy on the left is the same as the copy on the right. So now yes. the original one that you had that is made of two black, that is made of two black, okay, now you have two new ones identical. Two new ones identical, okay, but each one of them has a new strand, while the other has an old strand. Is it clear? Yes. Is it clear? I want the others to answer me. Yes, it is clear. Type the others. What about the others? Yusuf Hadi. Khalid, you didn't answer.
they even not writing they are even not writing in the chat guys where are you Guys, where are you? Yusuf, alhamdulillah, answered. What about Khalid Hadi? Khalid and Hadi, where are you guys? Clear in Arabic, ya Khalid, come in. What about Hadi? Faizan, this is how DNA replication happens. We take the old DNA, you open the two strands away from each other, then you build from the each one, okay, a new one. Tayyip Ahmed, would you please continue the box that you were reading? From the beginning, please. Yalla. From the beginning. <coughs> During S phase of interface, the double strands of DNA opened by helicase enzyme, and then its strand undergoes replication by another enzyme called DNA polymerase. Okay. At the, at the end, two new strands are produced. Each one of the new strands will twist upon one of the old ones. Semi-conservative. Semi-conservative. Semi therefore, therefore, two identical DNA molecules are produced. It's of those trends. Faizan, why you called it, Ya Ahmed, semi-conservative? Because you use an old one. Not so old. And you build with it a new one. Okay? Faizan, now, Inta, when you have in the end two DNA molecule, when you have in the end two DNA molecule, each one of them contain an old DNA and a new DNA from both sides but are they identically ahmed yes identical so that's why you called it ya ahmed into semi conservative because in each dna i have half new half old half new half, half old. old okay the next box please anna wait ya ahmed let's see if others can read okay thank you ya ahmed Let's see if others can read. Can Khalid or Hadi read? We have Ayan. Iman, where is Iman? Usually Iman does not skip. Najah. طيب أحمد would you please continue each double strand twist again by ligase ligase enzyme ligase enzyme to form DNA DNA double helix now you have to twist them back as it is from before to become double helix and and continue أحمد each double helix now each double helix DNA molecule condensed to form one chromatid. Thus, two chromatids appear. Therefore, the application of chromosome of one chromatid and two chromosome of two chromatids has occurred. Okay. Now, you have a chromosome of two chromatids. And that's why, Ya Ahmed, Inta, you called it before sister chromatids. Why you called them sister? Now, we said because they are identical. Now, we know why they are identical now we know why they are identical because each chromatid is made of dna they are copy but each one of them contain an old dna and a new dna right correct clear 
So did you see now what happens to the chromosome as being one chromatid to become two chromatid? How the DNA replication happened? How the DNA replication happened? طيب, let's look at the page at the bottom. طيب. Ahmed, uh, do you remember how much we said the length of total DNA in one cell? One DN the no. DNA in one cell, how long it is? No. We, we said that it is about, Ya Ahmed, 1.8 meters. The whole DNA. 1.8 meters. Okay, yani somehow your your size, Ya Ahmed. The DNA I'm of. I'm going to go to the next Your size. Okay, for as in the DNA of in each of your cell, Ya Ahmed, is 1.8. Type. Do you think that one DNA replication enzyme is enough to do all of this in a short time? Of course not. So that's why we need many. And that's why when you look at the DNA under the microscope during replication, you see like they call them bubbles. What do they mean by bubbles? In each bubble, replication happens. You have hundreds of DNA polymerase. The one that are doing the replication, we have hundreds. That's why we call it the DNA bubble. Okay? For as in you read this, Ahmed, please, the appearance. The appearance of many replication bubbles are different. Loci. Different places Five. or locations. Simultaneously, Simultaneously in the same time, Yani. Signifies that many replications are taking place in the same DNA molecule at the same time, which increases considerably the speed of DNA replication. Uh huh. Increase the speed of DNA replication because it's happening in many places in the DNA in the same time. Okay, in the same time. So, let's look at this important figure. Let's look at this important figure now. Taib, Dan. Dan now, look at the DNA. It is here, double helix in the beginning, on the left. It is double helix. Okay? Tab, let me see if I write Anna on this page. Ah, this is shared here. Okay, it's not the, the, uh, the PDF. Okay, I will try to do it next time, inshallah. Type. Damn, yalla. Let's discuss this. At the left, you have the DNA double helix, right? Um, yeah, yes. On the left, صح? where it is written original DNA. Yeah. Yes. Then you have replication fork, the place where the DNA is opening. Yes. Tab. The name of the enzyme, Yadam, that is opening the DNA. What is it called? Polymerase. La, the one opening, the blue triangle. Ah, helicase. Helicase. So helicase is the enzyme needed to open DNA. Oh, yes. The one that you use to open DNA. Okay. Now you have two strands. One up and one down. Sah? Yes. Okay. Now the yellow enzyme now. What is it called? Uh, DNA polymerase. DNA polymerase. How many of it you have here? Two. Two. One working on the upper strand, one yes, working on the lower down. strand. 
<laughs> so look, look what it is doing. It's taking a free nucleotide, reading the old strand and putting complementary. So if it reads A, what it will put the polymerase T. T. If it reads C, G. it will put a G. If it reads a G, it will put C and so on. Okay? Okay. You see how it happens? Yes. Faizan, using DNA polymerase. Using the DNA polymerase on both sides, each one is copying the, let's say, the uh, strand attached to it. Okay? Each one is copying the strand attached to it. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, any question now? Last, there's no question. Okay, yani clear, inshallah, how replication happens? Yes, yes clear. clear. Very good, alhamdulillah. Okay, tamam. Tayyip, let's try, okay, let's try. I will try now quickly to open a video to see DNA replication. I think I have one here. Just give me one second. I will take, I will get the best one. Okay, is it this one? DNA replication, uh, let's say. Uh, which one of these? Ah, yes, this one. DNA replication. Okay, let me share the other page. Type, do you see the video now? Yes, sir. Okay, let me let me make it play and we can watch it together. Yes. yes. Begins at a specific point in the DNA molecule called the origin of replication site. Initially, the enzyme helicase unwinds and separates a portion of the DNA molecule, after which single-strand binding proteins react with and stabilize the separated single-stranded sections of the DNA molecule. The enzyme complex DNA polymerase engages the separated portion of the molecule and initiates the process of replication. DNA polymerase can only add new DNA nucleotides to a pre-existing... So as you can see, the polymerase is this big one, uh, purple or pink. It's reading the blue one, which is the old. And making a new one, which is also a pink. So when C, it puts a G, T, A, A, T, C, G, A, T, and so on chain of nucleotides. Therefore, replication begins as an enzyme called primase assembles an RNA primer at the origin of replication site. The RNA primer consists of a short sequence of RNA nucleotides, complementary to a small initial section of the DNA strand being prepared for replication. Now this DNA polymerase. polymerase is then able to add DNA nucleotides to the RNA primer and thus begin the process of constructing a new complementary strand of DNA. Later, the RNA primer is enzymatically removed and replaced with an appropriate sequence of DNA nucleotides. Because the two complementary strands of the DNA molecule are oriented in opposite directions and the DNA polymerase can only accommodate replication in one direction, two different mechanisms for copying the strands of DNA are employed. One strand is replicated continuously toward the unwinding, separating portion of the original DNA molecule, 
while the other strand is replicated discontinuously in the opposite direction with the formation of a series of short DNA segments called Okazaki fragments. Each Okazaki fragment requires a separate RNA primer. So as you can see, there are two DNA polymerase. Each one is working on one strand. In the end, you get two strands that are identical to each other. Okay, identical to each other. Okay, is it clear now? All what you need to write in YouTube, like I wrote it above, DNA replication. But I chose this animation, okay, because this is a very good one. But you can watch any one of them, no problem. Okay, it will help you to get more information. Type. Okay, very good. I'm trying to find for you a kind of a question. Yes, this is an easy one. Right, we take question 33, okay, it is an easy one. Okay, I will send it also on the group if someone doesn't have the book. Right, who doesn't have the book until now? Who still doesn't have the book? Everyone has the book? Okay.
طيب now you have the question on the group okay now we have it so please this now is going to be a graded homework okay a graded homework so that's page uh, 33 uh, let me check bus uh, again please it is page around 64 or 65 okay can you check in your book yeah then please and tell me yeah i'm sure which page you are now 46 type لا 64 من احنا we did the question 26 و 27 اه اوكي we did the 26 و 27 right yes okay فايز on which page um 66 like to 66 هو page 66 صح yes okay فايز on page 66 I will write it directly for those who have the book page 66 okay homework graded for saturday but please no one send it send it let's say tomorrow night Tomorrow, 5 p.m. maximum. Okay. Okay, tomorrow, 5 p.m., it will be the maximum time to send it. Okay? Type. Okay. Any question, guys, before we close?